morning, good evening, good afternoon, and wherever you are, hello. My name is Delane. With me, I've got Kaz Caval. Do you want to say hello, dude? Hello. What's going on, guys? And we are doing a skirmish for you a special video. And we're going to be doing Attack at Dawn, level 49. So we're doing a Jiro Skirmish. I'm just boosting up the level to 49 because Kazguvel is uber powered. And hopefully we'll be... I mean, we should be fine. So without further ado, let's get this going. But feel free... <laughs> <laughs> feel free to check out Kazguvel's channel. I'll have a... I'll have the text up somewhere in the video, you'll be able to see it. And if you click on the text, you'll go straight to his channel and you can see his lecture let's play in its entirety. He's done how many episodes are you on now? Oh gosh, between all my Lord of the Rings, it was probably over two hundred now. Oh my god. You're not stopping <laughs> either. <laughs> I can't I can't keep up with you. I'm not No, I'll be loading up I think number one seventy Eight or nine tomorrow. I, I can't even keep tab, uh, keep up on it now. <laughs> for just my room keeper. You're doing really good. <laughs> but this is Kaz. He's the dwarf in menace. He's gonna take. Hold on. Select lot. Oh, you've got to be kidding right. me. I can't select you. You're too strong. I can't pick. I can't click you. Ah well. <laughs> right. So I'm gonna stay at a war speech. Whee! There you go. There we go. There's Kaz Kubo. Here I am. God damn dwarves, he's always hungry. Eating all this food, greedy pig. I can't I can't talk. I know, right? Gotta have my It was Chris it was funny, Chris uh, Chris asked me today on the channel, he's like uh he's like he's like how come how come your dwarf is so quiet? My room keeper he cause he has an elf room keeper, he's like my, my room keeper is so damn loud. So I told him it's because uh dwarves fart so much, they you know, <laughs> they, they kind of like Deafen their opponents and and dull the senses around them. Oh, jeez, let me. I, I have not done a skirmish in friggin' ever. So we're gonna have two warriors. Why not? Might as well go for the kill. But um, I was gonna say it's like also dwarves can use is it daggers or they can use actually use some kind of weapon if they want, which is kind of. I don't know if they changed it, but when they first brought the character out, you could have a dagger or something, which is kind of pointless because you wouldn't be able to use your skills. Which kind of sucks. Right. Yeah. Right then. So, Priest of Vengeance. Oh God, what do they do? I forget there. Is there anything we could pull him out starting? The only things in there, my soul is going to go Hello, straight maybe. in. Hold on. Four. Well, our warriors uh -oh. are going to be idiots like they always are. Uh oh. That's what I was afraid of. <laughs> Let's see if I'll try to get them off early. That was a bad thing for me to do. Here it comes, Fury Words. Go for it. We should be fine. <laughs> Seven. Okay. I am so not used to healing. <laughs> oh my god, they completely owned the priest. Whoa. Oh, auto losing works on here well, as well. That's good thing about the warriors. Yeah, overkill. Mine's like level. What's the guy's got in mine? Equivalent to level 51. So, like, when I was. You remember if I did my early stuff, like Oscar Rubin stuff? There was, was like one shot in almost everything. Yeah. Those were the days. Those were the days. <laughs> <laughs> now, you might think we're a bit backward, guys, doing oh, this, okay. but we're just going to kill some of these ads off so that they aren't going to affect us with the um, mast. Oh, God. Tempest of Flame. Let's focus our soldiers on the Tempest. I'm sending my okay. shrine to the Tempest of Flame. Do you know how to direct your character over, the soldier? There you go. Awesome. Yeah, yeah I do. I just had tap for it. So I'm turning down my setting at the same time. <laughs> this is how I record, folks. I do it all on the fly. So I'm just a little bit worried that you're not going to come through on the mic because of the game sounds. Oh like well. Ah oh, well. Gosh, I hope I do. <laughs> <laughs> Are you Wait, come through loud and clear? You when I made the co-op. All oh, right, that's good. It's like World War Three when we're fighting stuff. You can't hear one. anything. Perfect. I know, right? Well, I always have my audio so so low, dude. So I don't know. 
I mean, I, I guess our setups are completely different. You actually use kind of like a boom mic, right? Type thing. I used to. I've got the blue snowball. But I'm looking to reinvest into a oh, boom mic again. But the one I want's about $300. So, not going to be getting that in a while. Hold on. Ouch. It's a good job you're probably... Okay. They're, they're probably like green to you, aren't they, these things? If I remember correctly. <laughs> oh, yeah, they are. <laughs> I'm just trying to get my, my AoE dots as much as I possibly can. That's all, really. Keep the battle going. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Get this um, scaling marker real quick. There we go. Oops. This is what I get for playing at this time of the morning. I missed it. Yeah, I completely fail on it as well. At this rate... Yeah, it's hard going from... It's going hard for, you know, it's really hard going from, like, you know, DPS to, or solo play to, to being a healer, if you're not used to it. It's, it makes it more interesting. If, if anybody ever asked me to be a healer, I'd friggin' cry. <laughs> I'd be like, sorry, did you ask me to <laughs> heal? What's that word mean? I don't know what healing is. Um, oh, you mean <laughs> yeah. to kill things quickly so we don't, yeah, okay, I can do that. Oh, that's not healing, is it? No. Oh, okay. Well... I don't know what healing is, so I'm not going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I would just ring, ring it out until they were like, okay, we get it, shut up. <laughs> we know you don't want to heal. <laughs> God damn it. Well, we'll have to do this skirmishes more often, because I'd like to try and do the higher, t the higher tiers. Actually. Oh, hell yeah. We've got them things. We need to go back out and go around, don't we? Uh, to unlock that other door. Yeah, that's a good point. Oh god, am I, am I already have to full? Unlock, unlock that door over here. I forget. I forget as well, to be honest. Oh, does it not even matter? It's this way. Oh god, move, move, move. Yeah, that's what I thought. Well, it says central gate, so I'm presuming oh, I'm we're walking the gateway. Oh, it's this way. It was I'm gonna go unlock it real quick. I'm gonna go and kill these things. Right. Oh no no oh no. Oh did you are you getting killed? Hee <laughs> hee. No no no. I don't want you to get killed. Oh I'm not gonna die. I'm too powerful. No, I'm just unlocking this this left door. Oh okay, sorry, I completely forgot about that one. I'm coming nah, soldier. Yeah, yeah, cause uh once you clear it you have to Alright, here we go. What are you going to call your? If you decided what to call your oh, soldier yet, because you? you can rename your soldiers. I called mine Jim. <laughs> Must probably leveled up. Ding ding. Must probably call him a nettles lover. <laughs> oh, where is my soldier? Come on. Oh dear lord. Come on, guys. There you go. Sending him straight on. Go on. Stun. No, nope, they're immune. I always forget about that. At this point, I might go war speech just because we're not really dying, are we? <laughs> no, we're not. Definitely go DPS if you want to, bro. We're, we're doing fine. I'm gonna go. Get Guile. I remember, I can, I can do some healing too, so it's not gonna be that big of a deal. True, we need to get Zim, where is he? Well, not that you... Not that you forgot, though. I mean, you have a freaking level 75 room keeper. <laughs> ah, it's all good. I, you could probably show me some <laughs> things now. I wouldn't have a clue. Uh, Western Gate. I seriously doubt it. Ah, it's all yeah, we good. we have to go up this way. We, if you come with me, I think we can go and get the... Uh, what's it called? Zimarb is the encounter. Where are you? Where are you, Zimarp? Did you go down? Yeah, I've gone back down. Uh, you went to, back down this way? Okay. Yeah, we got this guy. Ouch, this, this um, boulder's hurt. What is he? Elite Master Orc. I mean, we're not going to have any trouble killing it, so we might as well. Oh, I didn't know about this. Yeah, they're encounters. Oh, they're cool. totally optional, and you get extra rewards and stuff. 
And sometimes they drop flags, what you can place down, and it'll debuff them or it will help do damage and stuff. Shadowrooken. Um, back up a bit more because oh, you're gonna he's get fine. attacked. He's gonna get a oh yeah, you put yeah. Hadouken. I haven't done this one for ages. So how does it feel to be the more powerful one this time? <laughs> <laughs> feels good. Feels, feels fantastic. <laughs> That's cool, man. I didn't know about that one. That's awesome. Thanks. Yeah, if you just keep an eye in the middle of your screen, you'll see. I mean, it might be it might appear on your right because you've changed your layout a bit, or your left, sorry. Or if you look in the bottom left, you'll see like the blue text encounters, and it will kind of tell you where to go. Okay, okay, cool. I'm going to go into War Speech. Yeah, I seriously consider making a minstrel. Because uh, for the longest time, whenever I played MMOs, I was always like a medic or a healer type class. And hmm. It wasn't until later on that I, I switched to more, you know, like sword board or DPS type um well, that's the beautiful oh, thing about the Runekeeper being the glass cannon. You've got so much flexibility in a short space of time. And the good, that's the good thing about the, the instance finder. If you don't want to do DPS, if you don't want to do healing, you can just select DPS on the on your roll, can't you? So that's <laughs> the best thing. Right. Straight onto the Priestess. Ooh. Dude, her arm looks awesome, dude. Ooh, the courtyard below. Let's go back down, so there should be another one. That's interesting. We've had two... Yeah, here we go, Frib. Right. I know one thing I'm forgetting to do is put my time and the seconds of battle on. That'll debuff him a little bit and give him extra damage. Look at that. Oh, freaking sweet. Yeah, I think you can get between one and three per skirmish. Yeah, definitely worth doing. The arc of light coming down is awesome looking, dude. Yeah, I remember when the pictures came out and I saw it, it just made you shiver inside. She's like, oh my god, Star Wars is coming to Lotro. <laughs> and it was, it was so much fun, I couldn't <laughs> wait to play it. It was just so much. That was, that was the, that's the first, probably the first and last time I was looking forward to an expansion from Lotro. They're all really good, but my result was, you know, it was the precedent for the game. It was the first. Big move, but the best big change of it. What the hell's those for flashing for? All right, this is going to be a bit risky. Ah! Ah! Yeah, I'm already. I'm, I, keep, I can't stop thinking like a burglar. I get right behind them automatically. <laughs> oh, Stormkeeper. My soldier dead? No. Come on, buddy. Come on, come on, come on. Get it off. Can't help but think this orgy level. I was trying to get off my uh, scary marker. I totally missed the fellowship one. Oh, don't worry about it. It's all good. We don't need them. <laughs> we don't need fellowship maneuvers. We're too good for that stuff. I <laughs> know, right? Yeah, soldiers are bad ours, man. Wrecking people. I would definitely do a few of them if you can, because they're really good. And also, Eregion has a couple of instances called the Skull of Eregion and Library of Fam Mirden, I think it's called. And they both give marks for completing them as well. Yeah. Now I want to try and do some of those at some point. Sweet. Alright. This is where we can't... I'm going to have my soldier consistently on Grogue. And my swords, and I'll try. I'll keep an eye out for the escapees. So if you just keep on attacking, attacking him. Well, I should have my AOE here in a second. It's all good. I can take these down in no time. There we go. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's another one. Where are you? Don't you dare! No, Greg's over there, Jim. Where are you going? <laughs> God damn it, man. I don't pay you nothing so you can run away. <laughs> stupid, stupid man. That did look badass, anyways. 
Have we already done this? I can't believe we did that so quickly. Yeah, that went super quick, dude. Super quick. Awesome! I would you like to join the horn? Sure. Yeah, man, let's do it. All we right. got. Twenty minutes is enough time, isn't it, to do what you gotta do? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Well, I'm gonna. Where's, uh, where's the dude I'm supposed to talk to? Uh, him, isn't it? So let's call this one quits this video. Yeah, but he doesn't have the what you call it over his head. Uh, if you right click on your portrait, leave instance, and you can leave that way. Sometimes it bugs out like that. I think. Uh, so guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to check out Casco Force Channel. He's a pretty awesome dude. He's doing a let's play. Be aware though, like I said, it is a free figure let's play. There's like. Like I said, 190 parts, you said. So be prepared to be sitting there all weekend uh -huh. watching that stuff. I'm just too scared to watch there's it because I'm going to be there for years watching it. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe there's been a couple people that have actually done it, dude. And they've actually left comments every single video. And I'm like, you are insane, but I love you. <laughs> <laughs> and you're welcome to Mission Man. It's so good to have you job. aboard, definitely. But I'm um, just glad that you... Thank you so much. You deserve it. You know, a lot of people... A lot of people, you know, try so hard and don't get very far. But anyway, guys, see you next time, and, well, peace out. Adios.